Hi guys, Toby here for TP23 Productions. Now, watched the film the other night. Uh, it was a film I brought for my sister uh, for her birthday. Trouble is, I have uh, decided to watch it before her. And uh, the film in question is called Escape Plan. Now, Escape Plan has um, really only two main stars, and that's Arnold Schwarzenegger and Sylvester Stallone. However, Jim Caviezel is in it, 50 Cent is in it, and also you got Vinnie Jones. Now, like I've mentioned, it is a 2013 actioned thriller sort of film. Um, it's good to see Arnold Schwarzenegger and Sylvester Stallone in a film together. Uh, I think that's pretty cool because they are pretty much the two biggest uh, names in film in our modern generation. Uh, so that's cool to see them. Escape Plan is all about a guy that Sylvester Stallone plays and his character is called Ray Breslin and Ray Breslin is a guy who pretty much lives uh, to break out of prison. He will go into prison incarcerated as a proper criminal. He will get put through the system and all that. However he's, um, he's a guy who earns a lot of money to break out of that prison and shows companies how they could get their prison to be um, escape proof really. And that is Ray Breslin, Sylvester Stallone. That is his job. And that's pretty much how we find Sylvester Stallone. He's in a prison and um, he escapes. And uh, he tells the person of uh, whose prison it is how he did it. And then he gets paid a lot of money to do it. Fair enough, if you can get the work, why not? One job, he is uh, usual sort of situation. He gets paid a lot of money to be incarcerated and to break out. The trouble is this one time uh, he has a chip removed out of his arm so that his team, including 50 Cent, do not know where he is. Uh, so that's a bit of a twist already to the film. Stallone then wakes up in a glass box really. Uh, he wakes up and he doesn't know where he is. There are no windows, there are no doors. It's it's almost like Cabin in the Woods. It's like the glass box and Sylvester Stallone's in there. That's how I thought of it when I first saw it. Glass box, hell and dimensions and all sorts of creatures in there. And in one of these glass boxes um, are other inmates who's not on his own. And eventually he comes across uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. And uh, Schwarzenegger's character is called Emil Rottmeier which is a bit of a strange name. With his help, he plans to escape, and they're gonna do it together. Sylvester Stallone and uh, Schwarzenegger are gonna escape. And Stallone uses Schwarzenegger and his information and knowledge of the prison um, to help him plan a route out. This is where he meets Jim Caviezel, who is uh, the warden of the prison, and where he also meets Vinnie Jones, who's like the security member of uh, the prison. In all honesty, Escape Plan is an okay sort of film. Um, I think if it didn't have Stallone and Schwarzenegger as uh, the two main stars, then the film would not be very popular. It wouldn't um, really take off, and I think it would just be a bit of a dud that you find in a bargain bin in uh, some DVD shop, really. And uh, yeah, if it didn't have Stallone and Schwarzenegger, then it wouldn't be as popular as it is. And in all honesty, reading some of the reviews, they're not. it's not even a popular film. Uh, it hasn't got great reviews. I found it an okay sort of film. It wasn't great, it was okay. It had a bit of action, a bit of uh, comedy, the odd moment. It was good to see uh, Schwarzenegger and Stallone on the same screen, working together, trying to escape. And uh, 50 Cent was useless. I think he was a terrible actor. Uh, I've never really seen him in any other film, but yeah, 50 Cent wasn't very good. Vinnie Jones was alright. I thought he was cool. There is one major twist in the film. I'm not going to tell you. Uh, you'll have to watch it and find out. Um, to be honest, I saw the twist coming a long way away. I saw it a mile off and uh, wasn't really a surprise to me when it happened, should I say. But yeah, escape plan. If you're a fan of uh, Stallone and Schwarzenegger, then I think you'll like it. Um, it's a prison breakout sort of film. I know if you like The Great Escape, then uh, you might like Escape Plan. 
you're a fan of 50 Cent, he pops up every now and again. Fan of Jim Caviezel, you'll like it. And uh, same with Vinnie Jones. But uh, yeah, Escape Plan, it's okay. I won't get it for more than a fiver, really. So if you see it for under a fiver, it's not too bad a film and uh, okay priced. But Escape Plan, it's alright. It's not great, it's okay. So, thanks for watching my review of Escape Plan. Uh, if you're a Stallone or Schwarzenegger fan, then uh, it's probably one for you. And if you like uh, prison-based films, then by all means go out and get it. But it's an okay film. Also guys, I mention it every time, links are down below as per usual, We The Devoted. Use Toby WTD, gets you 20% off any We The Devoted gear, links down below as per usual. But guys, thanks for watching my review of Escape Plan. Hope you like it. Thanks for watching.